Welcome to my first thrift haul of 2020. It's January and I have a bunch of things to go through, so I'll probably do two or three uh, videos of my thrift hauls. So some of these actually started in December, but who cares? So first off, I got this gorgeous mirror at Value Village for $14.99 and I was in there and it wasn't a discount day, but I had to have it. It's quite large and it's very heavy. Um, I got these beautiful peonies at the one of the uh, Mission Thrift stores. Um, and they were $3, I think. $3 a bunch. So I've got oops, one uh, lighter pink, which is two strands. Strands. Two stems. <laughs> and uh, one of the fuchsia. And those will probably go into a beautiful vase like this one. This beautiful, as I love, cobalt blue. And it's got a really interesting mottled kind of pattern. I don't know what you would call it. It's kind of heavy. And shoot, I don't remember where I got that. But it, from the price tag, um, it's probably a Mission Thrift Store or something of that nature. This one I picked up on another time going to the thrift store, the Mission Thrift Store. And it's kind of a larkspur, I think. It's kind of really pretty purplish. And kind of faded looking, which I like that antique look. Um, at Value Village, I got these salt and pepper shakers. And my mom has some beautiful blue things that hang in the window. But they're double pointed. And they're similar to this. So I'm going to try to display those near that. Rather than actually use them for salt and pepper shakers. But I just love the blue and white uh, designs on that. Um, this is a base for a candle holder, which is obviously missing the glass portion, and it may have something that goes with it, but I'm probably going to use it as a base for something, and it was $8. Um, shoot, I forget where I got that too. I thought it was a Goodwill find. Yeah, actually I actually did. I, I did get that at Goodwill. I remember now. Um, I love these kinds of wooden cats, these carved wooden cats. I have a bunch of them at home. So I'll probably start a display here at the apartment when I get in there too, which will be in less than a couple of months now, hopefully. And that was $4.99 at Goodwill, and she's really tall. And then I also got this guy for $6.99. I thought he was really fun. I'm not really collecting these types of animals, but I think he'll look good somewhere. And he's very light and carved out of wood. Looks like somebody's used their hand in the back to carve it out. I just thought he was funny. He makes me laugh. He makes me giggle, especially with his little tuft of hair. <laughs> Anyways, I thought he was adorable. Um, uh, then I got this, oops, this girl. She says, so many men, so few who can afford me. <laughs> I thought that was cute. I'll probably hang that up in the kitchen or... I don't know, I'll hang it up somewhere, bathroom bed. And I love the beads on it too. That's so adorable. And she was $2.99 at Value Village. This farmhouse picture I thought was really cute. And it actually wasn't priced, so I sent somebody to price them price it for me, which I'm always dubious about because I figure if, if they think that you want it, they might price it higher. But anyways, for $2.99 I thought that was okay. And I really like the frame. Can see it's a nice substantial frame and it's a older picture it's already wired and everything to hang up but and it's just um what do you call it like a print on a you know it's not hand painted or anything but it looks like it is so i really liked it um and i found another farmhouse item <laughs> i love this rooster he's so majestic looking and i love his coloring and the, the background picture and it's it's a tray so I'll probably display that in the kitchen you know like leaning up against a backsplash or something and he was he was 10 bucks which like I say for my US friends is probably about 750 and it's got little rubbers on the back like it's a good it's a good um, solid tray but I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> so I'll use it as display. Or I'll even hang it up. I don't know yet. But I really liked him. Um, 
Then I got this. I love these mercury glass if I can get them for a reasonable price. And I put them in the hanging uh, macrame hangers, which you've probably seen if you've watched any of my previous videos. And that was a dollar. Um, goodwill. This mug I just thought was adorable to go with the farmhouse theme. Utterly irresistible. Come on. Ha ha ha. <laughs> and I think it was a dollar at Goodwill. Yep. Don't know why they have two tags on it, but anyways. And I don't think it's any special brand or anything. Um, this mug, oops, I just liked that Mexican theme. It'll go with some of the other Mexican things I've got going on. And it was a dollar. And it is hand-painted Starbucks coffee. Deruta, 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 Italy. That's funny, eh? 10 fluid ounces, 300 mils. They actually put the... So it's a 2008 Starbucks, which I don't see a lot of Starbucks mugs. Not that I'm really looking for them. And I didn't buy it because of that. I just like the pattern. Um, this also, this tray, it's just a plastic tray that you can probably get at the dollar store. I just like the pattern and the... Um, <sighs> like all the bright colors, especially the reds and blues, was $3.99. So it's just a plastic, uh, there's no markings on it or anything like that tray. Now, you might be wondering why I got these globes. So this little one here, and two big ones. So the little one was $3.99. This big one was $3.99. These were at different, different value villages. And this one was $12.99. So I asked them if they would give it to me for the same price as that one. And they said, well, this one has more features, blah, blah, blah. When I told them what I was using it for, and what I'm going to use it for is I'm going to cut these off and turn them into light uh, covers, you know. You'll see that in a DIY project later on. But I've seen them on Pinterest, and I think I saw the Sorry Girls doing it. Where they, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was them, where they drilled into the top a hole and a larger one into the bottom and put a bulb inside and it looked really cool and they had like three large ones I think and I wanted different colors and these are slightly different blues um anyway so they gave it to me for half price <laughs> of what that was because she said well it is a little high so she gave it to me for that and then this wooden tray is quite deep I'd say probably two inches and it's a beveled angle uh, it was only three ninety nine. Um, it looks like it has a winner's tag on the back for whatever price. I don't know, but that's okay. And I'm going to use it as a table topper, like for a. Uh, it's quite large. I'm going to put some legs on it <laughs> and use it as a table topper. And I think that's it for this haul for now. I will uh, take another video for second and possibly third hauls. Thank you for watching.